Hey gang, Bison here. Sorry it's been a few days since I've posted a vid. Uh, things have been busy and I was waiting for this to come in and uh, you know there's been a lot of bad weather. I wanted to do a few things outside but it rained for like four days straight. Then we had the holiday which worked out Sunday and then it rained again today. So anyway, what we're going to look at here is the uh, Bushnell Power Sink Bear Grills. This is the Solar Wrap Mini with rechargeable battery. Pre-charge at home, recharge anywhere. Here's some info on the front. Battery charge time in the wall is 4 hours. In the sun it is 10 hours. Charge your camera two and a half times, MP3 player two times, and your smartphone one times. We'll see. Proudly designed and engineered in USA. Take a look at the back. Pre-charge from computer or USB wall charger. Solar panel charges internal battery during daylight. High capacity lithium ion battery charges devices anytime. And it comes with the USB cord. Works with most USB chargeable devices. Lightweight, rolls up, compact, fits in the pocket or attaches to the backpack. Very cool. And I guess over here is where the battery is stored. Simple way to power your device off the grid. Grid. And we are again with the specifications. Battery output is 8 watts. Battery recharge from AC 4 hours. Recharge from solar sun. So that already USB ports are 1. Alright, let's open her up. Scissors. Sorry, the scissors are orange and gray. That was an accident. It is not a part of my orange and gray fetish. Alright. There's the usual dirty face shot. I've done a lot of stuff in the woods and never gotten that dirty, but it's okay, bear. Alright, first we have our USB cord. This part would go into it to charge it. This part would go into your USB port and your computer or wall outlet. Registration. Blah, blah, blah. Boring. Here's our instructions. Shows the different uh, charging connections. And a lot of the same specs on the outside of the box. So let's take a look at her here. Dying to see this. Yeah, very cool. So here it is. It's extremely light. I'll uh, measure it and put it in the description box down below. So let's see how it works. You just pull it here, I guess. No. Just unwraps. I gotta take the caps off, I think, first. Cap is off, and then it unwraps. Look at that. Very cool, very thin. Got a little clip here where you can put a little beaner on it, hang it off your pack, like so. Very cool. On this side is where a USB cable would plug in. We have our charging indicator. This is your input side. And this is your output side to go to your device. It does not come with a cable to go to the device. It states that on the box. And we have two Phillips head screws on each side. That's, I guess, where our lithium ion battery is. All right, so let me wrap it up. And for part one of the test, I will plug her in to a USB outlet and charge it up. And we'll see how long it takes to charge, if it matches the specs. And then we will see how long it takes to charge the phone. And then we'll repeat the test again in the sun. Probably a part two video to this. Look at that pretty cool covers. Nice job, Bushnell. We'll do a second video with a test uh, charging in the sun and see how long that takes. This is very awesome. Let me actually just take a quick wait on this and I'll, uh, I'll show you guys with the scale. Hold on. Alright, just want to do this on camera. Oops. I set up the scale. We'll see what she weighs, just so we all know. 
3.4 ounces. Very cool. All right, gang, so let me get it charging, and I'll do an update as soon as I have the information on that. See how long it charges in the USB outlet, and then we'll test on the phone. Thanks, gang. Be back in a bit. All right, gang, Bison back. Just want to talk about the results of the PowerSync Solar Mini Wrap by Bushnell. Another Bad Grills product here. This surprisingly performed fantastically. Um, the first thing I noticed last night was when I went to charge it via USB, uh, apparently this did come pre-charged. Um, per the instructions, the USB charging time would be about four hours. It actually was just shy of an hour and a half, and it was at a full charge. So I took it to work today, and I charged the iPhone 5 from dead, which... Apple considers dead like 20%, it was really 18%. Charged it up, um, took just a little bit less than two hours, and like an hour and 42 minutes, and it fully charged the iPhone 5. I then uh, took it into the car, what's up Edgar, and my iPod Classic was just about dead, so the drive home, which was about 40 minutes, and it charged that to about just about 90% before this died. So it it didn't perform completely as it as it stated. Um, but I'm happy with it for an emergency situation. It's so compact and so lightweight and it, it works for what I needed it to do. It charged the iPhone 5 one time like it said it would and uh, only one time with the MP3 player. So if I'm reading this right it actually did better than the specs because it fully charged my iPhone 5 and just about fully charged an MP3 player. So, guys, this is uh, aces in my book. So once this was dead, um, I, I took it home. I left it out in the sunlight for about, I want to say, six hours and change. And it fully charged. It fully charged. Um, on this side here, if we can see it, there's a diode. It lights up red when it's dead and it's charging and it's solid green when it's full. This sat in the sun for just about six hours and she was green. And according to the instructions here, it says 10 hours. So this thing performs slightly better than the specs for the charging time and performed, I think, slightly better than the specs down here. So result is, guys, this is a go. Go for it. I think I'm going to pick up a second one, one to keep in the uh, bug out vehicle and one to keep in my everyday bag. Can't have enough of these, they're uh, very important. So there you go guys, A plus results for the Bushnell Power Sink Bear Grills Solar Mini Wrap. Go grab one today, I found uh, this one, I pre-ordered it from, actually from the Bear Grills website. So go check it out, it was about, uh, I think it was about 80 bucks. Alright gang, thanks for watching. Bison out.